All right, here we are for another review from the average guy. Still got my dogs moving around. This is a fire table that we got from Costco last year, 2021, uh, for, I want to say, $1,600. And we thought for the price, the value that we got from it was phenomenal. We actually bought the floor model and it was the last one that they had in the store because these were in such hot demand. I'm in uh, North Carolina, and these things were going like hotcakes because normally, I think if you look out there on Google, to get a table that has a fire feature in the middle of it is usually, you know, at least $2,500 to $3,500, where this one was selling for fifteen dollars to $1,600. And the quality for what you get is pretty good. I mean, we've had it a, for a year, of course, and uh, we're just coming out of winter. But uh, I'll just take a look at these chairs, just kind of start off. So it's got kind of like that woven hard plastic material. And, um, you know, again, it's only a year old, but it's held up just fine. Um, I did not cover this up at all in the wintertime. I just kind of left it exposed and we're getting ready to clean it off because it's finally nice here. And we're going to do some barbecues and stuff like that and hang out and drink wine out here. Um, the chairs, they're made of a... A decent kind of uh, material it's like a strong it feels like it's you know maybe like an aluminum or steel I, I really don't know but um, it's not junk you know I think you know when you buy chairs and you feel them you're like man this is junk that's not the case with these so it's a good size table as you can see it's six chairs so we can comfortably fit six people at this table and it's been perfect for steak dinners or just coming out here to drink and stuff like that um this top of the table is really heavy it's made of um some kind of thick material um it took me and another grown person to lift this up and even then we we're struggling to get it on top so it gives me more confidence that it's made of quality this is the cover to the fire table i'll pull this off real quick I haven't lit this in a while, so we'll see if it works. Anyway, underneath here is the base. And then inside the base is where the propane tank is. And if you can tell by now, I had my leaf blower going. And the uh, leaf blower didn't get underneath here, so there's still some debris. But anyway, all you have to do to get it going is turn the propane on. And then there's this little system over here, which I must say can be a little bit finicky at times. Um, but you press in to get the starter propane going and hit this at the same time. And as you can see, we now have fire. So there's a base setting once the fire is going that's low and it won't cut off. I'll show you about what maybe like mid fire looks like. It's probably mid. And then if you want to send it full song, not a whole lot different because we got some wind, but... I usually run it just a little bit past low, so I like the little flames kind of connect. There you go. So I'll shut this real quick so you can kind of see. And it's great. Like, you know, we'll just sit down here and, you know, talk and hang out and all that stuff. So, again, we've had it for about a year and absolutely no complaints. Now... Will it hold up for 10 years? I have no idea. Um, but so far, so good. Again, we got this at Costco 2021 for about $1,500, $1,600. Um, did not have it shipped. Picked it up in an SUV and drove it home. And it's been awesome. It's been awesome. If I can find a link of it, I'll put it in the description below. But this is a hot commodity at Costco. When it comes up for sale, these things go really fast. We actually looked to buy one in 2020, and we missed out on it. And we had to wait an entire year to have our chance to get this one. So hopefully they'll sell them again in 2022. But I think as everybody knows these days, there's no telling what's in supply and what's not in supply. But again, if I find the link, I'll, I'll put it in the description. And hope you liked it. Thanks for watching. And if you like this video, go ahead and like and subscribe. I'll be putting out some more of some different things I've gotten at places like Costco and Lowe's that I really like. So thanks and take care.